What is your first thought about someone when they have a Confederate flag sticker on their car? That it is a weird thing to do here in Germany. Little anecdote in the 90s, NASCAR driver Dale Earnhardt put a Southern Pride sticker on his personal pickup, which had a Confederate flag in its design. When one of his employees, an African-American woman, saw it, she told him it made her uncomfortable. His reaction? He immediately apologized, looked for a razor blade and scraped it off his truck. As an Australian I am often confused because there really are fucktard osses who do this. Do not engage. Missouri was not even part of the Confederacy, dumbass. For reference, I live in MO, and they are all over down here. I loathe seeing it in my home state of MN. The 1st Minnesota Infantry Regiment had an 82 casualty rate in Gettysburg. As a Louisianian. If in the South they're likely unaware they're racist or they're turbo racist. Outside the South I'm not only a racist. I'm also an absolute fucking moron. If American? Stupid cunt. If Canadian? Really stupid cunt. If it's an orange Dodge Charger, them Duke boys are nearby somewhere. Their heritage was around for less time than Taco Bell has had nacho fries. Racist trash. Loser. Dumb redneck. Racism and ignorance. I love when I hear people state in their own defense, I'm just celebrating my heritage. It's a shit argument. I have a lot of German, but you don't see me waving a Nazi flag around. That flag has a connotation to it. So does the Confederate flag. I'm also not saying we should erase or ignore that part of history. It's highly important to understand what was. But to be proud of it is a different story. They live their life with self-imposed blinders on. They do not travel far from where they were born, limit their experiences to the things that fit into their chosen culture, and are most likely undereducated. They are ignorant, and take pride in that ignorance, doing everything in their power to maintain it. You lost. Get over it. But mostly, they're openly racist. What a fucking idiot. Lacks any and all critical thinking ability. I used to see a guy around my old city who had a Confederate flag waving from one side of his truck, and the US flag waving from the other side. I wondered if he was at war with himself or just dumb as dog shit. Probably the latter. I'm going to assume that they're either white trash or just a fucking idiot. Traitor scum. What kills me is I'm a southerner working a contract in Maine and I've seen these flags in rural Maine. WTF man? I just assume they're racists and or idiots. Either way, I don't engage. They're usually a gun-happy group too. Racist. Calling it heritage doesn't work when you live in the North if it was ever an excuse in the first place. I've just got Southern pride we live in Michigan dumbass. Racist. I live in Australia and I've seen one. Absolute trash. White trash racists. It's usually accompanied by a FJB sticker and another either come take it or assault rifle. FML. It's about culture, not slavery. Conservative voter. That the phrase African American has never once been uttered in their home. The rebellion is over. You lost. Read a newspaper. They're definitely racist. For sure. Anyone who knows American history knows what that flag flew for. Also, they're looking for a fight. They do it so some woke lib will call them out on it so they can project upon or menace them back. Uneducated mega redneck. My first thought is in that they either don't understand the connotations or, more likely, prefers to thumb their nose at decency. Low IQ. I'm British, so I don't see that sort of thing don't care lol the confederate flag just reminds me of Ray having one on his wheelchair in trailer, park boys lol and in South Park when Daryl and his redneck friends keep waving it in the courtroom face with tears of joy. 
A five-year failed country is not a heritage. Having that sticker is purely hate. White, anti-intellectual, racist, asshole. That they voted for Trump and I need to avoid them. White trash. White supremacist. Racist. That they're fucking stupid. I'm grateful for then identifying as a racist asshole and to avoid them. They are ignorant racists. So I thank them for giving me the signal that I do not want any part of what they are spewing. That they're a racist POS and probably armed with a weapon they don't know how to use. They're the type of person to say the South will rise again. That we will never be friends. Stupid and racist. Even more so when I see it in Canada. That they count as three five of a person and should be treated as such. No education. It puts off a negative vibe for sure. We have a guy in our town that has a big, loud truck with a huge American flag and an equally large Confederate flag. They stick up out of the back of his truck and it looks ridiculous. In addition to that he is always flooring it and rolling coal all over town. I have always thought he was probably an asshole and then I saw him at the store berating Girl Scouts. Pretty much confirmed for me that he is, in fact, an asshole. Cunt. White trash. Not very smart and avoid. Proudly ignorant. 1. White trash. 2. Racist. 3. Not too bright. Shitty driver. Addition to being racist fuckbags, I've never seen someone with a southern flag that understands how blinkers work, or who stops at red lights. White supremacist. True sign of a loser. White trash. Angry racist dumbass. A racist asshole who wants the world to know they are a racist asshole. But the war of northern aggression. Here in the US. That they're probably a racist Trumpister asshole. In the Bible Belt of the US I see them pretty regularly. I just assume they're either racist, incredibly stupid, or in most cases both. Racist dumb redneck. Redneck moron. I just assume they're an A-dollar dollar hole. I'm from Ohio. A state that has always been in the Union. If I see anything here with a Confederate flag, I assume that person is a racist and an idiot. Definitely a good chance they're racist and using generic and transparent dog whistle rhetoric will tell you exactly how they're not racist. Where did this person come from and why am I in Florida?